songs and felicitations. Okay, the first round. Boom. <laughs> and oh, geez, that was just boom. unnecessary. You kidding me? You can't be out of range. Okay, where was I? Oh, that's right. War with everyone. <laughs> War with the Germans. Greetings and felicitations, YouTube. They're all the happy and way here. There's a jihad going for Iconium. There's uh, a war between Poland and France versus the Holy Roman Empire and England. The Pope is playing the weirdest game of neutrality where it's like, hey, uh, Poland, I'm gonna excommunicate you if you keep going to war with uh, Germany, but I'm gonna be allied with France. So I do believe I'm currently sitting on a, no, I do not have any instructions from the Pope presently. So I am going to, uh, uh, I don't know, invade Hamburg? I don't really have anybody to invade Hamburg with. Who do I? Nuremberg? Nuremberg would be... Would be brutal. Man, Magdeburg is a heck of a uh, strategic location for the Holy Roman Empire. I mean, there's the three cities right here. One of them is the is Frankfurt, all within striking distance of this castle. Man, for Central Europe, it is pretty much the castle. Uh, that instead. Because everything else is a city. Dang! Okay, well, that... Cool advantage by me. Sorry, Holy Roman Empire. I guess you shouldn't have declared war on me. Uh, okay, where is... Orders, my king. Are we ready to go here? No. Maintaining siege. We must be at the end of a turn. Because all my agents are like, yeah, we're done. Where's my princess? Your Majesty. There she is. Okay, no, she's done. He's I'm done. To serve, my lord. Yes. Whose time is up? He's done stuff. Uh, okay. Yeah. Ready to trade. That was the end of the turn. Let's end the turn. I've got a lot of money. Why did I end the turn? I could have, you know, done something with all that. Oh look. A spy. Candidate for adoption. Nah. Explorer's Guild of Prague, sure. Vienna's being besieged. Uh, I'm the number one ranked military in the world. That's right, I am. I'm the most advanced faction. And he escaped. Okay. The spy escaped. New family member, Nadzeja. Nadzeja is the current faction heirs. Wait a minute. No, you are not the faction heir. No, 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 no. You are not actually blood relative to this family. You were adopted, sir, Prince Radabor. I don't think so. No, no, no. Uh, the current heir should be him. Is there a way to set heir? I thought there was. Oh no, that might not be this game. Blah. Okay, so... Faction... Faction leader, King Zbigniew. My greatest general, King Zbigniew. I don't want... I don't want somebody I adopted to be the future king. There's blood relative right here! He should be the next king after Zbigniew. Oh, let's see if I can't get Raptor killed, I, I guess. Like, but then I'd have to kill Pyotr as well, because, uh, There's got to be a way to set the faction air. Right? Nobody tells me if I'm being stupid, just let me know. Me? Maybe I'm, I'm missing where it is or something. Yes. You know, I'm going to make myself feel better by Let's assaulting Yasi. Uh, yes, thank you. Thank you very much. I will accept your castle with no trouble. Only two battery grams, uh, they'd set it on fire. There's hardly anything worth sacking here, so we'll just occupy. Mission success. Four units of Polish nobles at my capital. Perfect. Let's repair that. Let's, uh, I mean, we'll upgrade it. Let's raise taxes. Uh, oh, it's a castle, that's right. New Strelzy, no thanks. All right, so I've saved my money for a whole turn, and now I'm at 1,100. 11,000, sorry. 
Um, Who is my top let's get the spy over here into Ryatsen. This should be fun. I don't know this one. The whole fucking bush. You know that guard is like, I'm gonna give it to him. I'm just, he's tried so hard, I'm just gonna give it to him. Okay, Georgina, boy, your son's Cossacks, bunch of worthless buildings. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, no big deal at all. A target, please, that's all I need. These aren't even a challenge for my, uh, for my assassin. his back into it. <laughs> Poor guy. Kaboom. Yes, Very good. I believe not. Very good. I'm gonna move him up here. As you wish. Yeah, honestly, you know what? The spy... His time is up. Uh, Who no, is my not the Spy. But, yes. Yeah, he can leave too. No, There's no, really nothing no, worthwhile no. at Ryatsen. But Moscow. Moscow's gonna be a fun one to, to mess up. We're gonna run down this uh, Milanese princess if we can. Tomorrow's journey awaits. Ah, uh, there's the spy. Yes, Lord. Send him back to Prague. I think it's time I upgrade Stetten. Uh, no, I will not be marrying her off just yet, especially not some 47-year-old D-bag with mixed loyalties. Pope Gregory is dead! Okay, that's a good step. Uh, now let's see if we can't get... Oh, simultaneously there's a crusade. Uh, for Cairo. Okay. My leader must join the crusade. The Pope has requested that King Spignev demonstrate his faith and personally join the crusade. Uh, or my reputation with the Pope will suffer enormously. I may be excommunicated. An Inquisition may occur in your provinces. <laughs> oh, God. That was his dying breath? <laughs> Do I have to listen to it now since it's a different Pope? Uh, they want me to blockade the port of Hamburg. Uh, I guess that means I gotta recruit boats over here. Sure. Fine, boats. So, uh, the Holy Bible may okay. preach peace, but when it is Christendom itself that is threatened, then it is every Christian's duty to defend all that is holy. His Holiness the Pope has called a crusade to reclaim the Holy Lands from the infidel, who would deny Christian pilgrims their right to visit the holy places. It is time for the armies of Christendom to put aside their differences and unite under one banner, the sign of the cross, and give back God's children what is rightfully theirs, or die trying. Okay. 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 So, I didn't like how the music was overlapping there, and that's something that's just a problem with medieval too. But hey, okay, it's fine. Next up, papal election. Um, the choices are of the Venetians, the uh, the Milanese, or the. Sp Spanish. So there might have been some other shifts. So my relations with, with Milan are very poor. My relations with Venice are so-so and Spain's poor. But um, there's two Sicilian votes. One Hungarian vote. One French vote. One Papal States vote. And one English vote. Very poor. Terrible. Poor. Very good. Okay. Um... Uh, there used to be a way to engage diplomacy at this screen. Uh, hmm, okay, so I can't. I gotta make my vote now. I'm going to stick with my gut and say that I think... I think actually the Venetians are better for me than the Milanese. I can't remember... 
they're reliable. Reputation, trade rights, trade rights. I don't have trade rights in Milan. That's funny. Let's just uh, let's let's go with the Venetian. Who's the oldest? Can I see? I can't see their ages. Oh God. Let's vote for Evio because I bet you he's about to die soon. Okay, it didn't matter anyway. Uh, Pope Zappa has been elected. It's the Spanish candidate, the OG Potenville, driven by peasants. It's only this up, sir, is a place amongst the flames of eternal damnation for you. Okay. Okay. Has been named the new pope and guide to all Christendom. You were unwise to not go to, to go against them. Your lack of faith shall not be forgotten. The French voted for the Oh, the Venetian. That's the Venetian. Okay. Huh, okay. Okay. Alright. 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 Well, that was interesting, to say the least. Town of Breslau is ready to upgrade. I might as well go straight to that while I'm thinking about it. Uh, Venice has been reconciled. England and Portugal have declared a truce. Breslau. Breslau. Upgrade those walls. Cardinal report. Uh, hey, the Danish cardinal died. The new Sicilian... Relations of proportions with Denmark and Hungary. Yep. Milan and the Papal States hostilities cease, and Milan has been reconciled. Okay. Well then, I think it's time I go meet this new pope with my diplomat. See, uh, see what we can do. Okay. Now then, the Russians just built a massive army and then hit it over here. Hi, what's up? I'm gonna go spy on you now. Come on, Turek. It's a huge army, don't get caught. This guy saw somebody and then said nothing. He deserved his death. Good job, spy. Okay, four ballista, two peasants, a bunch of militia, and it looks like a couple Cossacks. Yeah. No biggie. Ooh, they've got a rebel. And is there a general? No, it's just a captain. Whose time is Let's up. go blow something up in Moscow, the shall target, we? Please. That's all I need. The inn. Blow up the inn. Oh my gosh, there's guards everywhere. Come on, Tomas. Oh, easy fire. Nice. Good job, Tomas. Well then. Oh, I've got rebels up here. Viking raiders. Okay, we're gonna join that crusade with King's Big Nef. He is a nine-star general. I'm at war with Egypt. Girard de Ridfort. A master of the Order of the Knights Templar, renowned for surviving his impossibly brave assaults. One command, one authority, one morale for all troops on the battlefield, plus two command when attacking. That is going to make uh, my King's Big Nev a menace in battle. Where is, where is the... Show me the face of the man... He's got a brilliant fool. He may look like an idiot, but this man is able. But this man is able to say the things his monarch needs to hear whenever he wants to or not. Is able to say. Uh, plus some personal security, five percent bonus on all trade income. Dang! Good job, brilliant fool. He's got a guard dog, drill master, and there's Gerard, the Knight Templar. Let's keep the assassins away, shall we? And no, um. No units that I can recruit yet, but then again, Smolensk is uh, probably very orthodox. And then I gotta try and send this force all the way to, to Cairo, so I'm gonna march it. I'm honestly I'm probably just gonna use it to, like, if I don't actually engage in the war, the Pope will get mad. So I've gotta move towards, towards Cairo, eventually. Uh, I can probably take over Alexandria. I mean, getting a foothold out here isn't a bad idea. It's just it's just a waste of my time right now. <laughs> I'm trying to do the bare minimum effort, but man, the Pope's making it hard for me. Pope Pope and the uh, the Rush the Germans are making it hard for me. Okay, well then, let's have another turn. Okay, battle time. Captain Nikolaus and his four hundred men, two ballista, two peasants, some spearmen, are coming. To, uh, it's Captain. Ch Schwalomir? Schwalomir? 
Schwalomir. That's a cool name. Anyway, uh, I've got a bunch of haggard units, but experienced fighters nonetheless who took over Vienna. We'll fight this one on the battle map. Mm, 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 mm. Foggy day. Okay. The battering rams are going to have to come through a, a barrage of towers. I like that. When your enemy runs away, don't be too keen to follow closely. Remember, his guts are quite watery by then. Nah. Okay, so yeah. Uh, a couple of ballista ladders, two battering rams. Well then. Let's make sure all of my cavalry is ready to go and attack some ballista once they moved up. Uh, that tower is manned. This one is not, so let's grab this batch. Put them right here. Okay. Got... I could actually put them right here, just in case. We'll see. I, I've got some some small numbers of men who can deal with whoever comes out of the ladders. So the battering rams, I'm pretty sure, are just going to burn. So let's start this battle. They're going to come at me with Ballista first. Going to let them get up. Let's go. Oh, they're really close to their to the armies. What are they shooting at? They're probably shooting at the section of wall, aren't they? Thought they might be going after this tower. He doesn't have any ranged units, does he? I'm just gonna get out here and shoot up these ballista real quick. Each shot is four percent damage. Can you? There we go. Okay, everybody's moving up now. Which is okay by me, it means it puts them in range for uh, for other shenanigans. I think they dropped their... they did. They sure did. Disable skirmish mode, get back inside. See, now these Ballista have, the prob have this problem where their own siege equipment is in their way. Oh shoot, some of my guys got caught. Get in there, get in there. It's just some peasants. Come on, ignore the peasants. I definitely hear my towers opening fire. I'm surprised they're not using flaming rounds. Okay, so I definitely took some casualties. But I'm hoping my towers might now actually be in range to shoot back. I need to bring that guy back inside so my doors can shut, please. I've created quite the problem for the Germans. <laughs> Roadblock! Looks like they are shooting. I don't see where. Ah, yep, yeah, they're back shooting that section of the wall again. Okay. Let's charge back out here and shoot this ballista some more. Honestly, I'm just gonna charge right on it. Before they can knock that over, I want to destroy this ballista. Huge charge. I'm not hanging around this time. Okay, everybody flee. over there. Kite the, uh, the infantry as best I can. Where's the other ballista? Its crew's moved off. Okay.
Uh, don't like that. I keep getting caught. <laughs> Like the coward he is. It's good. And break the spirit of his army. All right. Let's get everybody back inside. I've taken enough casualties on these raiding missions, but definitely proven a point or two. I mean, shoot, I'm gonna probably leave some of these guys out here at this stage. Only half the enemy force remains. Good. The battle is very much in our ship. If we remain true and steadfast, victory They've will lost be lost one of their battering rams. Don't want to stick around for those spearmen. Oh, hey, maybe I do. Okay, move off. Move off, move off. Next battering ram is on its way. being pushed by just the simple ballista crew. If they lose one more guy, that one battering ram is not going to make it, I swear. They don't have the crew to push it anymore. Yeah, there we go. But I think it's too close now. I'm gonna charge that spear militia. Cannot let them grab that bit of artillery. Run down that town militia. Here we go. End of the battle, I'm sure. Boom! Got it. Look how our Polish nobles. Runs. This is a clear victory. 20 casualties. And, and three of them were healed back. Alright! Oh, well, actually, now that I've looked at it and done the math, the 20 casualties is after the heals. Let's go ahead and see if they want to ransom mode back. Oh, shucks. Hey! Hey! I was doing business there! Okay, they left. Crusade grows. France has joined. I have my cogs now at Thorn, but guess what? Uh, is a... Imperial blockade that is much more significant than my dinky little little few ships. So I can try and build a relief force at Novgorod of Hulks. Let's go ahead and kill these rebels. Keep spying on this Captain Yosef. Krosisko. Trosisko. Trosisko. I think I was probably closer the first time. Ooh, I found Prince Ivan the Ugly. But I think I'm just gonna focus my efforts on buildings like the markets for now. Let's try and get myself a little bit better before I go after the, uh, the faction heir. Every job is more, is more experience. And more experience means better at killing. I now have three silk sources. Yes, my lord. Setting can, up a trade route. I can actually go for a fourth if I wanted to. Gosh. Sir. I'm tempted, because I, I know what this guy's up to. He's going to try and go after Smolensk. I think I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to put my... My Order, king... My inside these trees here. And hide. 
Our forces are hidden well here. Let Yosef move up a little bit closer, and then I'm going to go after go after this this Russian army, eliminate it, and then I'll send my guy on, uh, off on crusade. That'll be fun. Whoa, rebels! Okay, that's a pretty significant rebel force, I'd say. So this is Polish spearmen. 7 attack, 13 defense. So 13 defense is nice compared to like militia units. Let's go after this encroaching. Aha! Ballista, mailed knights, mounted sergeants, peasant archers, and I just sent out some Polish nobles, Polish Laharmen. Really, Polish nobles, they they do everything. <laughs> they are they they are good at every job. <laughs> Oh, man. Now, I did uh, appoint a new general. Here he is. Zhurnawit Chisinski. Chisinski. Let's retrain these guys. Oh, he's turning south. Is he going after Yasi then? If he's going south, then I'll pursue him south. It means I'm still making progress towards uh, Cairo. No. I would speak with you this day. No. A shame, but <clears throat> your caution is not unwise. Very well. Mazalama. Adoption. No, thank you. Holy Roman Empire agent detected in Prague. Uh, that's where I have a priest. What are you talking about? <laughs> thank you for pointing out that I have a priest. I need to start sending my priests off. To the east. Got some castles upgraded. That's good. England has been excommunicated. That's good news. And I got another. Uh, I got another cardinal in. But this one's also unorthodox. What the heck's going on? Why are they taking all my bad ones? <laughs> oh, always well, upstanding, but quite unorthodox. Plus three unorthodoxy. He would be up to nine piety right now if it wasn't for all that orthodoxy, unorthodoxness. Yes. Keep spying on Yosef for me. Good job. Oh my goodness! Look at this. Honest battle. Okay, let's. Uh, which which would I rather? I think I'd rather go after this force in the field. Is that their king? No, just a family member. Marching to battle with At night, auto resolve it. Ransom. Rejected. Finish that force off. Yes, Lord. Boom. Ransom. Yes. Shucks. Man, they're still alive. What jerks. Blow up the blacksmith, I guess. Good job. Papal States hated that. Look, I'm yes. trying to get my army some experience, alright? Alright. Hold on, like, cavalry, Kuma, horse archers, I don't want any of them. <laughs> the Pope's like, these guys are supposed to be going after Cairo! Uh, yeah, 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 I got distracted. I mean, one thing's for sure, they're sure as heck not going to be able to invade Smolensk anymore. <laughs> the, that is for sure. Orders, my lord. Marching to battle with pride, Lord. The enemy lies defeated. We are victors. Yes, Lord. Come okay. the enemy. This the enemy rebel battle looks like it's going to be fun. Uh, ooh, Imperial Knights. Okay. So I've I've pushed back that Captain Edmund's force, and then I was in a great position to deal with the rebels that are gathering outside of Magdeburg. So, I'm gonna do it with Bullish Law and Chess Law. This will be fun, but this will be next time. So, talk to everybody. I love you all. And I'll see you guys in the next video.